We'll be getting there shortly. But for now, Phil, I want us to start by crossing over uh, to Laikipia, where the Investor Forum uh, has been held today. And to tell us more about that, our senior reporter, Carol Derry, is now joining us uh, from uh, Laikipia. And uh, thank you very much, Carol, for joining us uh, here on Friday Briefing. So how is uh, Laikipia seeking to uh, sell itself to the outside world and to other Kenyans as far as the forum is concerned? Betty, good evening. I was listening in. Quite a beautiful show. I love the songs. <laughs> but let's you. come back here to Laikipia County. As you've mentioned, the Stakeholders Forum that yes. has been going on. Uh, this is a partnership between KTN, uh, their co-sponsor in it with Sendeo Holdings, just to ensure that the stakeholders come on board and meet the leadership of Laikipia County government. And Betty, you know, devolution is a concept that was intended to bring services closer to the populace so that the citizenry can access services perhaps uh, you know previously in past regimes those areas where the services are not quite um, apt now with devolution this has become possible so this stakeholders forum that has been held here in Nanyuki Lakeipia County has according an, an opportunity for the stakeholders for the investors to meet with the leadership and to tell us more about that none other than the governor Lake Ipia County Derito Muredi who is playing host to this very important forum that uh, allows him and his government to meet the investors and the stakeholders thank you very much Buona governor Derito Muredi thank you quite a forum here for you to meet uh, just tell us about the opportunities that like keep your house to offer because it is the 15th biggest in terms of size and uh, it has quite a lot of attractions, tourism, ranching, farming, and a lot of other things. So just tell us about this forum. Um, as you rightly say, and thank you first of all to KTN and the other partners, uh, this is um, a government and stakeholders, investors, uh, some of the top business leaders in Laikipia, about 120 of us, uh, discussing, interacting. Uh, looking at how to expand uh, the opportunities for businesses in Laikipia. Um, we, as you rightly point out, from tourism, from agro-processing, um, uh, service industry, uh, tourism, uh, livestock, uh, all these fantastic opportunities out in Laikipia. Um, and therefore, as a government, we stand committed to ensure that uh, we are we are providing the right environment for businesses to thrive. All right, quite aptly you've said the con a conducive environment for this to thrive and flourish. Now, unfortunately, like in the recent past has been in the spotlight for insecurity. I've heard you speak about the initiative, the Amaya Triangle, where you've brought uh, four counties together to try and tackle this. Could you tell us about this particular initiative? Uh, the initiative brings uh, four counties together, like Ipia, Isiolo, Baringo uh, and Samburu, uh, a farm commitment from governments in these counties, um, as well as in partnership with the national government to change the economic outcomes uh, and alternatives for people who live in that zone and also create a platform for innovation around uh, pastoralism. Uh, because, yes, uh, we... we uh, cattle and livestock a very integral part of the lives of the communities there however we would like to keep cattle in a modern way so we are looking at innovative ideas including feedlots uh, including um, uh, pasture uh, or fodder uh, production uh, fodder storage uh, so that uh, we, we are getting value for our livestock Okay, Buena Governor, in your view, what have the challenges been facing devolution? It was a noble concept, but uh, there have been pros and cons of it. What are some of the challenges that perhaps the governors together, the national government, need to critically look at? Um, a couple of areas still, um, for example, disease control for livestock, um, which is devolved, but uh, the coordinating mechanism to get counties uh, to work together uh, needs uh, to be improved. Uh, in addition, the transition mechanisms, um, and we are experiencing across the country uh, some hiccups uh, with transition uh, from one uh, administration to another. Uh, so, in fact, the, the Senate law, or the law that had been introduced in the Senate to govern this area, uh, needs, in fact, to be looked at uh, very, very rapidly. Uh, and I think, thirdly, is the capacity, uh, particularly of the institutions such as the uh, public service boards, uh, that are expected to professionalize, um, but they themselves, uh, in many instances, require capacity. 
Um, and I want to point out uh, the Public Service Commission was out here this week uh, in an effort to help us uh, or help our board uh, to be able to up their game uh, and find us the right um, HR. Thank All you. Right. Thank you very much, Governor Derry Tumuredi, like Ipia County Stakeholders Forum that is happening here, bringing on board different investors, stakeholders, the leadership of the like Ipia County government, just to exchange ideas, to open up conversations on how best to ensure that evolution is a success, to ensure that people's lives are made better.